Hi everyone, welcome to Design School MC. In this video, I will create house logo design. Okay, um, first I will select the pen tool over here and I will create object like this. You can follow me. Okay, like that. And I will edit this point using direct selection tool. Click this point and scroll a little bit on the right. And in this point too, a little bit going up. Okay, I think that looks good. And select the pencil again and create object like this. Click over here. And click here. Click here. And click here. Close this point. And I will edit this point a little bit down. Maybe like that. Okay, like that. And once again, I will create new object over here. Click here, 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 and here. And I will change the color using purple color like this. Double click on the fill, I will copy this color code, right click and select copy. And select this object, I have scratched uh, this. And double click on the fill, right click on the, oh, this dialog box, click page, click OK. Alright, and I will select direct selection tool or you can press E on your key and adjust this point little bit down maybe like that and this point two little bit down okay and select the pen tool and create object like this click here click here here and close this point and I will adjust this point a little bit on the right Maybe like that, and this point two, a little bit on the right. Okay, <clears throat> and in this point, a little bit down. Maybe like that. This point, uh, this object two, a little bit down. And in this point, a little bit going up, and a little bit on the right. Uh, maybe like this. Okay, like that. And, um, Create uh, object using rectangle tool box object like that Maybe like this and duplicate this object go to edit select copy edit pitch in front and Put this box uh, over here and select this box go to edit select copy edit pitch in front Okay, and put uh, over here and select this all box right click and select group and put this box over here and change the size a little bit small click this point and scroll a little bit going up okay like that and put uh, on the top a little bit on the top like this okay and I will create um, something line to make this house look so much better click here here and scroll like that click here scroll like that and click here click here scroll like that and click here scroll like that and close this point and scroll like that maybe I will uh, create new point over here click here and close this point and scroll like that okay and uh, select direct selection tool to edit this line select this point and edit the line like this okay like that this point a little bit going up and this point two, a little bit down, okay, like that. And in this point two, click this point and click this point, scroll a little bit on the right, okay, like that. Maybe uh, this point a little bit on the right, this point a little bit going up, okay, I think that looks good. And select the pen tool, create another uh, curve like this, click here. Click here, scroll like that, and click here, scroll like that, click this point, click here, scroll like that, and close this point and scroll going up. Okay, maybe I need to edit this uh, point like this. This point, a little bit going up, and this point, a little bit going up, a little bit down. In this point two, a little bit down. 
um, maybe select this object and put a little bit down okay like that I will create uh, another curve over here and click here scroll like that and click here click here scroll like that and close this point I will adjust this point a little bit down this point a little bit going up maybe like that Okay, uh, I think that looks good. Maybe I will cut this object using circle object. It's like ellipse tool over here and create circle object like that. And put this circle over here. Little bit down. And select this object. Go to part finder and click minus front. Okay, I think that's much better and select this object change the color using green color okay like that and this box object and this line change the color using gray color dark gray color maybe over here and this object change to green color like that um, maybe I will um, remove this object and select this object change the rotation like this put off here maybe I need to change the size a little bit small maybe like that right click select group and put a little bit down and a little bit on the right too okay and I will create text house devs and change the size to bigger maybe like that okay and I will change the font style to another font I will looking for my best font for this house logo Maybe I need to change the regular to bold. I'm not see the bold over here, so I will uh, looking for another font. Okay, this is bold. Select the bold and change the size a little bit small. Maybe like that. Put on the center okay I think that looks good and I need to change the color of this text using green color in this dev is green uh, maybe this dev is dark gray uh, maybe this gray dark gray and the house is green color okay like that and select this all logo this text too right click and select group zoom out and change the size a little bit bigger and put this house on the center maybe like that okay i think that looks good okay guys i hope you learned something in this video and if you have a question you can leave a comment below and if you are happy with my video tutorial don't forget to click like share and subscribe my youtube channel to get new video tutorial every time i update new video and you can go to my youtube channel in design school mc you can type design school mc in youtube search and you can watch more video tutorial and see you on the next video